Hi guys, Jake here again for another St. Virgil's College YouTube video. Uh, I've got a workout to focus on our core strength for all the running we're doing with our uh, online cross country that we've been running. Um, we've got Mount Wellington up behind us here. I'm actually on campus right now. We're starting to see a few more people coming back and looking forward to seeing you boys get amongst it back here. And I just thought I'd remind you just what it is that we have in front of us and, and the view that you know some of you might have been missing. We've got the Derwent River there um, and it's probably a good time to start thinking about one of those character strengths we talk about a lot and that is gratitude. Gratitude something that um, can be very helpful in our lives. It's a really great character strength to focus on and I think now more than ever we've got a lot to be grateful for and um, while we're doing this workout I'd really like us to, to focus on, on that and think about the things in your life that you're most grateful for. And, and I know that for me, I, I'm very grateful for where we live, where the school campus is, and I can't wait to get back out in the environment that surrounds us in all of our outdoor ed pursuits. But I'm gonna get straight into a workout now while we do it, let's think about those things that we're most grateful for. All right, we're doing a plank and reach to start with, okay? And what we're doing is we're reaching straight out in front of us. Try not to roll too much, and you wanna be as stiff as possible, okay? This is all about our core. Our core helps us a lot when we're running keeps our posture really great and it helps our back while we're sitting down doing a lot of walking. Okay, now we're gonna go side step. Okay, I'll move around. So you can see, breathing in and out. So it's just, just like our plank. And our core is starting to hurt a little bit, which is great. A few more. Keep going. Okay. All right, moving on to our back. You might need a mat for this. And as we come up, and opposite two opposite you can go all the way up like that but you got to be really slow curling back down oh, otherwise it's just Opposite to opposite, which is just fine as well. Okay, Russian twist. Okay, you can have your feet up, which is really a lot harder. Um, and you're just basically tapping side to side. You don't want to move your, your um, legs around, sorry. It's just knees up. And if that's hurting, or it's a little, hurting's good, it means you're working hard. If you're really struggling to keep your feet up, then you can have your feet down, okay? And that's fine, make sure you keep breathing one side to the other. And this is all about getting that core through your abs, working hard, okay? So, side plank lift on our side, Arm up and lifting up, lifting up, lifting up, lifting up. Just got to check something. Okay, still going.
so it's uh, much better if you're just down on your elbow head up here or a hand on your head or on your hips either one's okay Okay, this is what's called a superset. We're going to do it all really quickly now. Okay. Straight out. Straight out. Straight out. So it's just a plank with a reach. Try and keep it as straight as you can. Flat as you can. Alright. Runner's crunch now. Okay. Keep it going, we're almost done now, just nice and quick. Smash these ones out and we're on the home straight. Abs are burning. We've done a good job. Alright, well done. Five minute core workout, really good for your running, posture, and your back. If you can get a strong core, you're going to have lots, um, a, a lot stronger and more easy um, life in the future with your back. A lot of people have back problems as they get older, but strong core is the answer. All right, catch you later.